That's me. Yeah, I know. I had to change it up a bit tonight. Uh, yeah. I'm Lona, and this is... I'm Mike. We already said that. Oh, okay. Well, he's the star of the show. Okay, so t on tonight's episode, oh, I guess we're doing one and a half recipes, because you pre-made the crepes. Oh, yeah, the batter. The batter. So we're actually doing crepes with fresh strawberries and whipped cream tonight. Fresh whipped cream. We are using the Whip and Mix Chef. Not you. Chef. So, we already used this to make the crepes. So, these are actually a gluten-free crepe. Uh, very tasty. And he is going to cook them in the 9-inch Chef, Chef Series 2 pan. Uh, you know that's a frying pan, right? And it's heating up. It's hot, yes. Okay, so you can start the crepes while I talk about and make the fresh whipped cream because it literally takes... You're going to make the whipped cream? <clears throat> oh, no, no, no. You're going to do it. <laughs> All right. I'll just do the strawberries. That's the easy part. Okay. I'm not <clears throat> using this thing. No, so actually the whip or the mix, the whip and mix chef <clears throat> has an attachment that you can measure oils, creams, uh, um, oils, creams. Anything you're, any liquid you're adding to it. Oh, liquid. That's the word I was looking for. And it, <clears throat> hey guys, it's Monday. Yay, Monday's almost over. <laughs> I've made it through Monday. Still have four days left this week. Okay, so you can actually measure. So you pour it in here and then you turn it and it'll drain into the measuring pitcher, which has a handle. And if you notice, there is one cup of whipping cream in here and he didn't need a measuring cup. He just poured it in here because there's lots of different measurements. You have milliliters, liters, cups, ounces, all on here, which is great. It has an anti-slip skid bottom. I feel like I should time you. Okay, you can't start yet. This also has two settings. One for uh, batters that are a little bit less and... Um, Ones that are thicker. Thicker, yes. So obviously whipped cream isn't a thick batter. I didn't say go. Okay. Two, one, go. So it should only take about 30 seconds, maybe a minute to make whipped cream. This is a great time to get the kids to help you. It's a very kid-friendly recipe as well. Okay, that's in 15 seconds. Keep going. Okay, keep going. Is it getting harder? It's also a great workout. Okay, keep going. One more. Okay, that's in 30 seconds. Oh, it's starting to peak. Okay, do 15 more seconds, and then I think you're probably good. Now, this does have a pour spout, but keep going. Um, the attachment on top has a little catch so that none of the liquid goes out while you're whipping it. It's getting hard now. Okay, keep going. Just, just a second more. Okay, you're good. Oh, yeah. Focus. Sometimes it's hard, kind of hard to focus. Oh yeah, and you I can just lick this it. just like you lick your beaters. Or like lick the beaters. No, so, <clears throat> the reason that this is so effective is it actually has th uh, three sets of two beaters that spin so fast of a rotation as you're spinning once. So it's actually more effective than your beaters. So we just made fresh whipped cream in literally 45 seconds, but like, I don't know, two minutes of on, on screen time. And then in the little mini power chef, we're just gonna chop a few strawberries. And these are going to go, normally you cut them just a tiny bit smaller so that they fit into the chopper. Now, if you want something nice and chunky, you don't pull it as much. If you want something nice and fine, then you're going to chop it or pull it a lot. 
Again, anti-slip. So we're just gonna give this, that was three pulls. And look at that. We have nicely chopped strawberries. Ooh. Are you done with crepe yet? I know that's asking a lot. But guess what? This Whip and Mix Chef is on sale right now. It's regularly $82 and everyone, it's on for $49. It's 40% off, which is a huge, huge deal. So the gadget right here, it's quite handy. You can uh, mix batters, like we mixed the crepes. You can also mix uh, cookie, cake, all sorts of different batters. You can make fresh meringue, you can make butter, lots of different things that you can. Salad dressing. Yeah, salad dressing as well. Great, dear, look at you coming up with these ideas. Mm. And it's all dishwasher safe, of course, because that's a necessary feature. So. I'm gonna try this. Oh, oh, everybody watch. Oh, he actually did it. I can't even. Boom! <laughs> I got it on camera even. <laughs> I can't even do anything. Okay, high five. You, 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 that was a good one. Okay. So anyways, Whip, Whip and Mix Chef is on sale until next week. So this is a great oh. item. Mother's Day is coming. What? Yeah. I, I like those things and then you stuck it back in there. Oh. <laughs> right. Okay, well, the only person eating this will be people in this house, so... We won't tell Michaela. <laughs> yeah, don't tell Michaela that her dad licked the beaters and then I put them back in, again, the batter. If you're just joining us, fresh whipped cream, it's not coming out. So, are you almost done? Almost, right? almost Ooh, done. it's nice and browning. I will post both of these recipes. The whipped cream, super simple, tiny bit of sugar, little bit of vanilla, fresh strawberries, and a crepe. And what's in this crepe? Like just five different ingredients maybe? Not too much. There's only a few. Yeah. But again, like I said, Mother's Day is coming. This is a great product to give moms if they're bakers, grandmas, a special lady in your life. Not to mention, we have some great other deals on right now. Wonderlier bowls. Wonderlier bowls are on, so I'm covering them. Just for another week. So, and these colors are gorgeous as well. So again, don't forget, what woman does not want Tupperware as a Mother's Day gift? It's a gift that gives and keeps on giving with a lifetime warranty. So anyways, specials, whip and prep, Whip and mix, chef. And the crepe is coming. Crepe is coming. Oh, this is supposed to go in my hand. Okay. Oh. With a little bit of strawberries on the side, some whipped cream. And then Mike said, because you know munchies with Mike, it's all about Mike. You should have probably actually put the whipped cream on the inside. Oh, yeah. And heck, with breakfast, you can have crepes for dessert. Oh, oh it's it, it, yeah. yeah. <laughs> it's so hot. Uh, it is. But there you have it, folks. In less than six minutes, no, sorry, in less than 10 minutes, we made fresh whipped cream crepes with strawberries and chocolate sauce. So, how is it, Mike? I haven't tried it yet. Well, yeah. Oh, I approve. <laughs> this recipe has been approved by Munchies with Mike. I hope everyone has a great rest of their week. Happy Monday, and we'll see you next week.